Anyway, so yesterday was, if I remember correctly, <laughs> I, I have my cheat sheet here. It's, it's 95. Yeah, day 95 of protests in the city of Elizabeth City uh, that is wrapped inside and, uh, you know, taken prisoner by the county of Pasquotank County over the police shooting of Andrew Brown Jr. So we had a smaller group yesterday and we did downtown sidewalk demonstrations throughout uh, the major restaurant areas on Saturday morning. A lot of people trying to enjoy their brunch and uh, we were protesting and it made them very upset. As you know, I'm a big fan of brunch, huge fan, huge fan. And so we wrapped around, uh, we went through downtown, we wrapped around uh, toward Erring House and then Road Street, making a ruckus, going back downtown several times. And uh, I was all in all a pretty good demonstration considering the low turnout. But again, you can't have hundreds of people every single day, so we're trying our best here. And, uh, and so again... Uh, the main thing that's extremely important is that a demonstration is being held every day. Right now, there's a lot of people that are in the planning stages and are trying to, um, you know, gear up for day 100, which is this Thursday. Uh, so today, or yesterday was day 95. Today will be day 96. Um, then day 97, then 8, then 9, and then 100. Uh, and so, that should be landing on a Thursday if my math is correct. I mean, let me just verify this. I don't know. I'm going to do math live on stream. So, it's 96, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, it's on Thursday. My brain is a little... I did a lot of drugs yesterday. But anyway, so, uh, yesterday we did... Uh, we had a lot of good, uh, you know, interactions from people in cars. A lot of people showing solidarity while they're on their way to work and stuff like that. And uh, so, again, that's really something that's super valuable when you see that kind of stuff. Like, there's so many people that can't come out and directly participate in demonstrations. But um, they, uh, you know, they will show support. And that's a good thing because it really shows you that, you know, the city as a whole is supportive of the protest movement. And it's not just like a handful of people that are doing it. It's actually like, you know, a lot of people are very supportive. They just do not have the means um, to be able to show up every single day or that kind of stuff. And so again, and it's also super fun when you're walking down the street doing a demonstration and you see someone that you know from a protest who is on their way to work and, you know, they have a stop and chat conversation and, you know, it's, it's, it's just, you know, it's a really heartwarming experience. And again, I just want to say I'm super proud of Elizabeth City for holding down the fort for 95 days in a row. It's incredible. The, uh, you know, just the absolute and, and you know, the grit uh, for this is just, it's something else. And again, uh, we did a good job and I hope everyone um, enjoyed, you know, our demonstration. That was, you know, day 95, folks, in the books, in the books.